Greetings everyone and welcome back to the new stream. Now, we have returned with some more Andrew. And I wanted to say that even though this doesn't make any sense for YouTube, we have actually reached episode 30 today. <laughs> it will probably be like episode 28 on YouTube because I do know I have missed out on two episodes. Uh, my mistake, sometimes I get lazy and I forget and just think to myself, have I downloaded this video? Let me go check. And then suddenly the video is not available anymore. And I'm like, fuck. But luckily, as far as I remember, you didn't really miss out on much. Uh, but that's also been like seven, eight episodes ago. So by this time, you probably wouldn't care anyways if you're watching this. Um, but yeah, so we have returned with some Andro and probably going to get into the expedition. Something I just have no clue about because I have finished this game before, but I... I consciously decided myself to not do some of these quests because I, I wanted to have a reason to replay the game again. Whether that was through a stream or just on my own time, didn't matter to me. I just knew that this game was so phenomenal and it's been such a long time since I could really get into a game that I thought to myself like, you know what? I probably, wanna, I probably will replay this. So let me skip a couple stuff so I can do them on a second playthrough. And then if I do a third playthrough, then yeah, I would have gone through everything, but that's uh, that's fine, I think, by that point. So. I was also playing uh, Arcania lately, which people would dislike, given I am a Gothic fan. But um, yeah, sometimes I play Arcania for the fun, because it, it can be a good game. It's just a bad Gothic. But um, some people might always be like, why, why do you always start your interest like that? Because I always have a certain way of like, everyone could just be like, oh, welcome back to my YouTube channel, blah, blah, blah. Welcome back to my Twitch channel. And I just always start by screaming greetings. <laughs> and today I got to the part in the game where I explained to my girlfriend that there's this NPC in Arcania that after you have exhausted all uh, dialogue and finished his quest and you keep clicking the character, they always have like a sentence to say. And it was Lord Gawan and he keeps saying greetings, greetings every time you talk to him or try to talk to him but there's no there's no like dialogue anymore so he just screams at the whole time and i thought you know what to me that just sounds so funny i'm like i just i gotta keep doing it i gotta keep doing it myself and so here we are doing it for each and every single fucking intro sometimes i miss it out oh god don't kill him don't kill him don't kill him okay it's the the father but is it it's it sounds and acts like a woman uh, that's completely fine. Okay, and there's a book here. Spirit enables you to enter the realm of the spirits for 12 seconds and become unable to attack and immune to all damage. That actually doesn't really sound that bad. Teachings of the Father. I'm gonna guess one and three are the same, but you just get more or less seconds. So, nothing new with that. Very fucking creepy, but you know what? Let's get the fuck out of here. I do not want to be up your business, sir. Good day, brother Sorrow. Oh my god. I love when a game makes me actually feel like I'm in danger, regardless of how powerful my character has become by this point like i love infiltration missions where the developers have definitely made sure that any mistake you could make you could be outed and you could fucking die so you're just like on the lookout 24 7 to make sure you do everything right and that's what i like about that. i i'll say it I, i'll say this i'm not sure this game actually knows or cares if you actually change your robes because you were warned, but I did change robes before and nothing realistically happened. I keep forgetting how to get out of here. But uh, most games where it is like that, then yeah. Like, I know I talk about... Oh! Oh, is this just a way to get in? Oh, right, sorry. Uh, I know Gothic 2 has it, to ascend. Oh. 
because uh, in Gothic 2, you basically have it where you need to, in the DLC, you have to infiltrate the bandit camps. Um, and it's kind of spooky because someone knows who you are. Uh, so you need to be careful with that and you need to play his cards well. And you also get ropes to look like a bandit, but the moment you remove those, they attack you on sight. And I, I like those little things. Granted, Gothic 2 did a very, like, like, it was very limited technology at the time. But something like that, but updated, would have been phenomenal. Especially in a setting where the way your character becomes so powerful that you kind of feel safe in any territory. If the game is able to make you feel unsafe, regardless of your stats, After all these then, yeah. That's just plain crazy. That, that would have been great. I bet you came to watch those fools cut their guts open in the dust pit. I think the best way to make you feel unsafe would be by just um Do you snobs ever come down here? Hey, bloody wench thinks she's how, do I, how do I get, well, get what's The best way to make you feel unsafe is probably by having a character you like, uh, whether it's an NPC or something, feel in danger and any mistake you make could bring her or him to danger. Because bringing yourself to danger, let's be real, like at some point you can be so overpowered that it doesn't really matter what type of character starts attacking you, you could probably just take a whole army by yourself. Um, but yeah, I think you get the gist of it. I tried to explain myself a thousand times, but I feel like I've pretty much explained my uh, myself well. Oreo Kun, buddy! How are you doing? Do you actually like Oreo? Or is it just like... I don't know. Now you're quite the sight. How about a little The vanilla kind. Are those the 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 like yellow kind? The yellow ones? Cuz I have taken those before and they're actually very good. Ah okay, fair enough. My girlfriend doesn't like them as much, so we always fight which one we want. And so last time we went to the store, uh the normal ones were empty. I said, hey, you fucking bitch. Let's get the vanilla ones now. <laughs> My turn to have fun. Okay, it's here-ish. Oh, it's probably this door. Yeah. So I always, like, double vanilla the taste of it because I, like, I, I might have explained it before. I have like the package of Oreo, I put it in like some sort of like vase and I have these like wooden thick sticks that you use to like mash things and so I crush the Oreo into pieces like to the point that's pretty much dust and I always get like uh, just pure vanilla ice cream, they're usually like in actual boxes and you can easily spoon it out because it's just very soft. I put that in a bowl and then the, the dust Oreo that I've pretty much mashed into pieces, I like put over the ice cream. And so, yeah, that's just how I get fat. Granted, I do it like once every two, three weeks, I think. But it's, it's, it's good, man. It's good. Sometimes I pick up the normal Oreo purely because of the texture, because it you can see it a little bit better. It was really good. It was really good. Which way is to... Oh, it's at this place here. Do I have to sit down? Oh. What the... Oh, you... I take it you accepted the father's invitation? Yes. Tell me. I see. Though I still don't understand why the father wanted you personally. That's not like him at all. Either way, now comes the critical part. This Maybe the father wasn't the father and it was like a... The fact that he someone acting for him. Is a good start. Or her. What about the third mercenary? How do we convince him to join our cause? Join our cause? We don't. 
and kill him the first chance we get. The last thing we need is an additional risk. Is there no other way? We don't even know who it'll be. It surely won't be anyone deserving your pity. Almost everyone whom the Rolada would hire has earned their death a million times over. Just remember what the first year asked of you as a symbol of trust. I suggest you head to the temple as soon as possible. I'll probably arrive with the father. All right, until then. Until then I'm counting on you. Four stars, man. I get the feeling this is going to be beyond fucking dangerous. Well, we go to the Frostcliff Mountains. Nothing else about it. We go to the Frostcliff Mountains. Let's go to the Mirage and uh, say our piece. Where's the Stein? I can barely see anything. I hope it's daytime. Um, oh, it's about to be. It's 3 a.m. Then it's okay, I think. It's fine. Moin, moin, moin. Yes. Walk blessed, friend. We are going to... Actually, hold on. Back. Um, um... Yeah. Before I want to get into that adventure... Uh, I actually want to buy some skill books for my stats because... I could use it to get my light armor up, which means I could get some extra damage resistance. Just a little bit, though. Because I'll get, like, I think I'll get, like, one armor rating per 10 levels. But then it's four set pieces, so if I level it up 20 times, that's at least eight bit of armor rating extra, at least based on just my calculation. But this game probably uses something else, so. so the marketplace, we need to... <laughs> We need to either sleep away because no one is. Huh? There's no yeah. shop open right now. I probably don't have. I have 5,000 pennies, which probably won't be enough, but I have a fuck ton in the bank. I'm not gonna worry about this. At all. Get in the bed. Marketplace. Wait, I don't need to be here. Yeah. What do you want? You're an adventurer, aren't you? Oh no, he goes like, "You're a foreigner, aren't you?" I heard you talk. Walk blessed. Show me what you're selling. Sure. Take your time. It's not as if there's much to do down here anyway. I don't know if you're sarcastic or real. Wait, so what's the stat right now? It's on... The light armor is on 60, so it means I need to buy 15 expert and 10 master. Travels. Sure. I need a couple more pennies. Can I sell anything or did I like already did all that? Um Yeah, I now have the money to get what I wanted basically. Okay. Right. Uh da -da 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 -da. ten light armor master. Wait, what the f- Okay. So I probably want to get enchanting as well, but I'll th I'll do that later anyways. Okay, so right now I have an armor rating of 196. Can I help you? 196 to 216. Okay, so I get I get 20 more armor rating. You know what? That's not so bad after all. I can live with that. 
So I need strong leather. Can I actually up? Wait, wait, wait. Am I finally able to upgrade? It's probably yes, I am. Ah, ah, oh there. How are you holding up? Any news? No, not really. Okay, okay, okay. I need strong leather. Strong. Can I make strong leather? No, I didn't kill any animals that can make me strong leather. I'll have to buy it then. Crazy, isn't it? Uh huh. But I've heard the same thing. Aye, sure. You know, Take your time. It's not as if there's coast. much to do down you here anyway. Fuck, where do I get strong leather? The man is gone. Just like that. Shit. I do need strong leather. Uh, there's a there's a hunter also at these wares. Yes. Of course. Mm. No, they don't have strong leather. Fucked. Um Before the expedition, I could actually go hunting. I'm sure I can find like a an animal that gives me strong leather or something. That is annoying though. Dang it. Acts like a sublime. Some people just don't know their place. Um is she alarmed? Yes. Let me see if there's something worth it here before I start. That's just normal leather. Hmm. Some things never change. I do need strong leather though. That seems very important. Does the general goods store have it? There's a general goods store here. Uh huh. Put them out for you to look at. Tell me what you need and be quick. Mm, so I do need to go hunting. Dang it. Any specific area where I haven't been to where I could hunt stuff? I could maybe find some more things around the powder desert. That strong leather seems very important though. Because I can literally upgrade my armor rating by like... If everything can get up by like 10 or so, that's another 30 points of armor rating in total. For these pieces. Oh my god, that Relath excavation is all the way over there, bro. Do I... I'm guessing I have to follow this path, but holy shit. Or this path. Okay, definitely have never been there. That's going to be interesting. I'm sure enemies respawned at the sun coast, but damn it, man. Maybe there's some harsh animals outside Ark, but I kind of need strong leather. Mm -hmm. Let me just go outside Ark for a second, see if they respawn. They usually respawn after a couple in-game days, and it's definitely been so long since I just walked outside around here. So the possibilities are there. Maybe killing cows would give me strong leather, but again, I hope I don't get um, attacked by the locals. How am I missing this? Because technically, yeah, I'm getting crime, even though no one was able to see me, though. That's very annoying. I don't know how that works, but okay. I'm glad <laughs> I didn't accidentally shoot 
There's scraps to kill though, that's kind of nice. Let me go grab my normal sword. Can always use 20 XP. I guess a deer pelt wouldn't really give strong leather. I'd have to find like a bear or a tiger or something in that caliber. That's a shame. Is she a traveler? Could maybe check her wares. Hello. Uh, Trade? Huh. Well, I well she has ambrosia. I'll take mean. ambrosia and some arrows from her. Otherwise, she doesn't really have anything. Although, Karenian arrows could take those. I don't have the money. Nah, she doesn't have anything worth. Ah, they, uh, they do respawn. I hear wolves down there. Again, they won't give me the strong leather. But that is okay. Magical symbol. Actually, a good thing I came here. I don't even... What? Oh, ah. well. Have I even been here? I can't even remember, man. I mean, it's not really a significant place. But still, I'll take the arrows, though. Nah, but I'm looking for, like, a, a bear or something. This doesn't really provide me with the, the needs. Where does this lead? I think the Vatiers have strong belts. Can I make this jump or will I die? I can make it. Do Vatiers respawn though? I'm actually not sure myself. But they would be giving me strong leather, I think, if they have hide. I find it odd that I had nothing in my inventory that could make strong leather. Because I haven't really used the tanning rack as much anymore. Do they respawn? I think they don't, because I definitely don't really see anything right now. This is as clear as it's gonna get. Yeah. Maybe there's a dead body I forgot to, uh, to loot. There's a coin purse that I forgot, I guess. Oh no, they're very much alive. Sir? Eee? That was a bit frightening, but they could give me the... They give me an ear and a pelt. That could actually count for heavy leather. Hopefully. Well, I still, I would still need one. There was only two of them? Oh, that's kind of sad. But if I can only find two, I'll definitely just uh, upgrade the chess piece. 
if I have no other choice. I remember being here like, what, 15 episodes ago? Being surprised I was able to take on the Vatir. I was uh, so happy, man. It was like, it was a different time, man. Look at me now. All powerful and like... I mean, they'll probably just give me normal leather. Speaking of wolves, I'm, um... I, I, I was about to say I forgot to mention, but it's like, it, it, it was, it happened in between my previous stream. Uh, I'm planning to get a new tattoo with a... I'm trying to look into forest moon and the face of a way and the face of a wolf uh i say plan to i have an appointment this wednesday to get an idea out so they could draw it out and then probably in a couple weeks afterwards i can finally get it done so it's actually it's gonna happen soon it's in the making i'm excited for it man it's gonna be so cool Get fucked. See ya. Probably more skeletons. I mean, hey, it's just 30 XP. It's not that much, but I'll, I'll take whatever I can get. It's, it's easy XP. It says I'm in combat, but I have no one fighting me. Okay. Probably a crab that got angry, but he's too far away to get to me. I understand. This is the Dark Valleys area now, I guess. Not much around it, it's just all burned down to the brim. I don't know if I fully explored this area when I came here. I assume it was, at the time, it was too dangerous for me to attack. There's, a, there's an entrance through the water here. Oh my god, bro, we found just another magical symbol. I'll take that, man. 120 XP. I mean, it still takes a while to level up. Because I think I must have ended the stream just... When I leveled up. I think I have been here though. Isn't this where the dwarf and spiders are at? I hear skeletons. And I don't have that many silver arrows left. But I actually need to buy silver arrows. If I want to get into the expedition, because they mentioned there's a lot of uh, undead. Was that all? I probably have been here. I just, I must have just missed that magical symbol at the time. Got her. Nice. I have been here though as well. <laughs> so, but they they have respawned. That's pretty much it. They've respawned. How much ambrosia? Oh, how much? 
Am I on? 14% on the Arcane Fever. Nah, I can wait with the Ambrosia, but it's a good thing to have. I'll probably open this, but then grab all the loot. No. Take everything, though. Ghost Curse, very nice. Can definitely use that. But I'm looking to get heavy, strong leather. I'm back on the outskirts. I'm back here. Oh, shit. Okay. Ah. At the same time, I think... Way. Being able to upgrade my... A uh, gear twice only should be more than fine, I think. Let me go kill the crab. Maybe the deer will give me heavy leather as, or strong leather as well. Who knows? We'll see. We'll see. For now, uh, we're gonna go and return to Ark. We actually don't have a teleport to Ark. I can go to the Undercity, which is also in Ark. Probably should buy a couple spells again. I, I disappeared for a few seconds though, what the fuck? <laughs> Really? No one's surprised? I just suddenly appeared here? I hope someone can finally make a lore explanation for teleporting, because... I don't know any right now. Now you're quite the sight. How about a little bit of fun? Nah, cost money. Can't, no can do. If it was free, though, I uh, I still wouldn't do it, but I appreciate it. How the fuck do I get? Where the fuck? I mean, I'm not that well known with the barracks. Oh, I don't know where I am, man. I'm looking for the for the sign. Actually, tanning rack. Let me check if I can get strong leather. It doesn't give me strong leather, man. <laughs> Hello, handsome. Damn it, bro. Oh, this way. What is it so I hate that I can't get any strong leather when I just need it, and I've been getting rid of most of them the whole time. Well then. It's very annoying. Just when I needed it as well. God damn it. Oh well. There's nothing I can do about it. If I find the bear later on, I'll be happy. For now, let me go up and buy some silver arrows. I'll check if I can craft some myself, but... I doubt it. Let me go to the marketplace. At least I got some XP for hunting enemies, but... And a couple uh, magical symbols. So all in all, it was kind of worth it, but I, I just didn't get what I came for. Nothing happened. Of this holy, holy city. From this day on, there's war. Weather. 
I forgot what I wanted to do. Oh, yeah. Yes, very. Smelter! up. I could dismantle item. No. I was able to make a silver ingot, I guess. But I need wood again! <laughs> Damn it! It's always what I'm missing. Jesus, don't you have any morals, guards? Sorry. Stay where you Jesus, are. Jesus, don't you have any morals, guards? Stay where you are. You broke the law. Good, but it is Malthus and the righteous path you ought to repent to. Go. Uh, sure. That just happened. I didn't mean to steal, though. It's just... Yeah. It was in the way. I was trying to buy. <laughs> yes? The fuck? Monsieur? Probably. Yes? And now I'm here. Walk blessed, my child. How may I help you? I shut him the fuck up. I shouldn't be saying this at the graveyard, but shut up. Huh. Look at that. A fellow traveler. You have? Well, sure. Let me see. Or Man, you need. no one's got fudging. Fuckity. Fall. Strong leather. How hard is it to come by strong leather? Everything takes me to the foreign quarters. You guys sealed the door? Oh, you're not from around here, are you? I know that accent. <laughs> What accent? People always say that accent, but it's like, I, I... I'm not talking! I haven't spoken a word! <laughs> Whose accent are you talking about? Because <laughs> it definitely ain't mine. Because my, my English accent is shit. Because it, it's non-existent. Take your time. It's not as if there's much to do down here anyway. Do you now have strong leather? No, but you have you have one piece of wood that I would like to have. And the rest, I just want in arrows. I want silver arrows, 40 of them. I cannot buy any because I have no money. I can get rid of this, though. it would be more than enough. And a silver ring. Okay, let me see. It'd be this. Silver arrows. I can buy... I can buy 20 arrows. You know what? That's... Well. It's kind of okay. I don't know if it will be enough for the coming fight. How many arrows do I have now? Silver arrows. 42. Mmm... I think I'm gonna need more. To the bank we go! Get some of my money! Like 500 pennies should be more than enough. Walk blessed, my sir. Mm -hmm. 500. I'll get, back, I'll get it back on the bank in three days anyway, so... I'm honestly not stressed about money. I wish- I wish my- my fi Finances were just as good in this game as it was in real life because god damn I could be doing a lot of shit with this money Apples, dates, bananas, the freshest fruits right from the farmer's coast and Doonville Doonville? Would, would, a, would a forge have strong leather even though uh, you don't really work as much with leather? 
Looking for steel. Everything for the path avoiding soldier. Everything for the path avoiding soldier. Thank you. You have a lot of blueprints and ingots, as I expected you to have. Um, come again. Come again. I'm just flabbergasted. I didn't have any strong leather. The hunter's shop. Is it that hard to come by, lads? Really? Are you, are you bloody serious, mate? What's this? Alamoon's tailoring. <sighs> Would that have some leather? Technically, it could be. You're working with clothes. Even though you're mostly... Well-dressed, my sir. And my dame, of course. Walk less. All your heart could ever desire. Take a look. No, he doesn't have it. He has some okay ropes though, but it's definitely not meant for my character. May his light guide you. Come back if you find the time. What's with the accent? Alright. Okay, well, I'll go to the leather work and see if she has some silver arrows, because the one I was buying it from didn't have that much left, so. Yes. How Sorry! Be of service? I see some silver arrows there, though, I think. Oh, that's steel, maybe. Strong leather now. Damn it, you guys. Uh, silver arrows? No! Oh my god! No one's got silver arrows! What the fuck? Okay. I'll, I'll buy the remaining off of her. And I'll have to live with that. Even though I'm sure I have to fight undead even before I get to the fucking spot. Oh my god. Okay. Farewell. To the Frostcliff Mountains. Do I have a scroll for the Frostcliff? No. Then we just simply take a Myra Tower to the tavern. And we're going to set out on a long, long, meh, a long journey. That's what I just wanted to say, a long journey, because we have to run a lot. And I've never been there, so I'm not too sure if the, the road I'm going to be taking is the right path. But we will figure it out in due time. Yes, For now, we That's go right. to the sure. Rosscliff Mountains. I guess to the tavern. For the teleportation. Oh ho. Would you sell any strong leather, young man? Looking for steel? I can provide everything for the path abiding soldier. You got the same fucking voice, sir. But no. Is there is there like a hunter shop around here, maybe? I'm not too well known with Frostcliff's area. It looks very nice though here. It's also just very, very tiny. Can I help you? A fellow traveler. You have? Well, sure. Let me see. He's got iron arrows, silver arrows, fourteen. Take it. I don't have the money for it. Silver arrows, whatever I have left, twelve arrows. You know what? I think I can live with that. So the path I should be taking is up and then straight forward next to Castle Dalgala, but we continue forward and go all around here, follow this path until we get to the excavation. God damn. Oh my god. We'll see how far we can get, because I might actually be ill-equipped for this. But we will see. But now we won't have that many enemies, so I think I'm just going to go and call my mount so we can go a little bit faster. 
Hey, Oogie. Welcome to the stream, buddy. I hope you're doing fan fucking tastic. <sighs> Let's go. Because we'll be here for a while. Let me also save the game. Because, like I said, it's going to get dangerous. God forbid they respawn, man. Am I super strong yet? Um, to an extent, but the, the I can still get fucked up because I don't have that much armor. In his ass. But again, if I'm able to do sneak attacks, I can fuck some people up, though, like this guy. Hey there, buddy. Oh, this would give me strong leather, wouldn't it? Do I return for this? This could actually save my life. Hold on. I spoke about bears. And now I need it. Get back. Get back. Okay. People often neglect the defensive stats in RPGs. It's not that I'm not doing that, it's just like... Looking for steel. I, can provide. I can't get any uh, higher light armor right now, but I am working on it because I can... I was able to get a stat where... There you go. Enchanted gear can finally be upgraded and these outfits are pre-enchanted. So I wasn't able to upgrade them for a long time until I get the skill perk. Ooh, yes. I need steel ingot for this one. This would be... Nine. No, oh, they both give the same. Okay, let me just... Uh... Am I using that gaunt? Am I using those gloves? Yes. Just making sure. Okay. So now, because I had I had 216 before these upgrades, and I'm now in 254 armor rating. You know what? That's good. All right, now we get back to the long, long journey. The other thing about being strong in this game is, like I said, I'm using an extensive overhaul to the gameplay, and... I'm gonna be honest, there's, there's, there's not that big of an emphasis from the zero to hero road, if you know what I mean. There's games like Skyrim, where you're pretty much overpowered by the time you reach level 10. And then there's games like Gothic, where you get, you're fucking weak, and at a certain point, you kind of like overpower so much that you could kill anything this game is kind of like that but you just barely don't reach that level okay you died like 10 times fighting that dragon behind the pillars didn't you um yeah, but the dragon was also level 50, and I was level 39 at the time. Which probably still meant I'd die like five more times, but shit. That is a... What the fuck? Damn it, man. Woo! 
already undead. Those are my silver arrows, and I don't have that many left, so I'm going to pick everything up that I can, because... Again, I can only realistically do damage to them if I have silver arrows, and I bought every single possible silver arrow, and we're kind of stuck with what we have. So... Yeah... Well, that should be enough for now, I guess. No other arrows I can retrieve. Jesus. Okay, I need to start eating some bread or something. Uh, yeah, bread. To heal up. Anything worth? Ah, I, I get a piece of bread back, so I can just heal myself later on again. Chunk of a potato cabbage would be very nice. I probably have been here, though, because I had to take this path before. Every time I keep seeing wolves, I just it just makes me so excited for my upcoming tattoo. I just ah, just a couple more days. Just hold out longer. Yeah, you you call this fun? That hitbox is annoying, because it, it registers me touching the ground. What was that jump? Where did his... Where did his... His shield went flying. Hey. Hey, yo. Have I been on this path? Yes, but... Once we get to the crossroads... Uh, it will be new for me. Uh, from now on forwards, so... Kind of nervous, but we'll see. Man, this is going to be such a long day because after this, after this stream, I'm taking just a tiny break and I'll be recording. Oh, I already see him in the distance. I'll be recording another episode for Risen 3. We have uploaded two episodes as of now, and they, I've already recorded a total of five episodes. And I'll be recording my sixth one. And uploading the third one maybe today or tomorrow morning. That one is going strong. Stay put. Do not move. Damn it. Don't go. Oh, okay. Fuck. That. Dead. Okay. How much XP do I get? 225. Just making sure there's nothing around here. Oh. Goddamn nice visuals though. Man. A backpack. Some void salts. Alright. Yeah, I was afraid this would happen. I'm not going to have many silver hours left by the time I get to the excavation. And they did specify there'd be a lot of undead and that I'd have to be careful. How far am I into the journey? Oh my god, but I still need to do this whole bit. Oh my god, I might actually not be able to make it. That's a long trek. Is he rabid? No. 
Is there anything on the outskirts here? What? I thought, is that not a bear or am I just... No. I'm going crazy. Oh! It... it... Fuck off, rock. Woo! Keep the strong leather, though. I can use that for the last bit of armor later on. Anything here? Shit. Shit. Those are some big wolves. Yeah, they don't do as much damage anymore. Not bad, actually. I expect these, these enemies to really start hitting me hard. Could be because of the armor rating. It must have added, like, what, 5% damage reduction or something in total. Which isn't much, but... Man, I'll take anything I can get. Woo! What do we got here? Crystals. Alchemy Master of... of sneak Mana Potion. It's Frost Cliff. Okay, so I can return. Man, this video is suddenly starting to hit the, the algorithm again. And I am here for it, man. Can you please subscribe, though, you fucking... I mean, it's a bit of a shit comment, but we'll we'll let it pass, Chief, because it adds uh, it adds me to the numbers. You got pretty good headphones. Did you do research for it? Could have more sub bass, but otherwise pretty solid. Did I do research? Um, not really. I just knew a lot of people wore it, and uh, it was on sale at the time on my shop on this area and so i didn't really pay much for it but uh i do have to say i have been using it for years and it's just been quality sure there's there's not that much bass into it compared to most headphones but i'm i'm okay with that i honestly haven't really been looking for other headphones anymore and honestly if these ones ever go bad i'll just buy new ones of the same or if there's like an upgraded version of it the only thing i've been buying every now and then is at some point cleaning these pads will break them um so i just um i buy uh i buy new pads and put them over i think in a month or two they're finally due over to get some new ones again so but two new budgets, okay. I am planning though to get uh, a stereo sound setup for my PC on the days that I'm not streaming and recording because I'm not the biggest fan of having headphones on my head the whole time. And the whole thing's in your ear is, I always have big ears, so for me it's just very fucking annoying because they keep falling off. And I find them too uncomfortable anyways. Whoa! Oh yeah, that was the psionic attack. So it goes forward. I thought it was more of an AoE. I'm not too sure about that attack now. But okay. We'll let it pass, Chief. Couple kills is very nice. But I was... I was... Yes, you know the things that you just... They're just very tiny things uh, they always drop i can never really make them fit in my ear yes actually to the point that i even try to just suck it in <laughs> it's a bro it just it's big it's slippery it's like also i i just didn't even like the feeling to begin with but 
at the time when I wanted to uh, start running outside, I wanted to actually use uh, those thingies because I didn't want to run with headphones. I tried that for a bit, but it's just very uncomfortable. And so I actually like tried to like tape, uh, but that was too uncomfortable. Then I tried to use like some sort of headband, but use it over my ears. That was also just kind of weird because at some point after running for a while, the front side of the headbands would just get in front of my eyes to my nose. And I was like, bro, that I tried everything. So I was like, you know what? I give up. So I started running without music and then that got tiring. Now I just got a fucking home cycling thing again. So I actually could go this way. It wouldn't bring me to the place, but I kind of want to know what's over here. Hey, princess, welcome to the stream. I hope you're doing well. There's a hut. There's a hut with a fire. And some, I'm gonna assume, marauders. Shit, I'd probably, I wanna kill the mage first then. Can I hide away? There's another fucking mage. Please go away, please go away, please go away. Okay, save the game. They were very close to finding me though. Baby! Fucking idiots! Oh! Well, you know what? I'll first tell how I'm doing, alright? I'm doing great. I have a... I have a tattoo coming up soon. Consultation first, and then we go and uh, actually get it done. I, uh, 12th of June, I have an appointment for maybe a new job. And also probably moving out to the north of my country, which is uh, three hours away. So it's going to be a very busy, busy time. Uh, so I'll still try to at least stream once a week. But if, the, if I actually have to move out, that might take a while. Another move. Yes, I know. It's fucking annoying. <laughs> I can't sit still. <laughs> uh, but tell me how you're doing. Why, why, why are you sad? This is, the f this is the second time I think you came to my stream feeling sad. Now, I know my streams are quite depressing, but I hope it's not because of me. That's a joke. I'm not that narcissistic. Come on, lads. There was still one other guy, though. I'm pretty sure there was. I'll be careful, though. For some, because my youngest was moving out. I mean, hey. If I can use my mother as an example, I, I had, like... We call, I think the term is like helicopter parents. It's like, even if you try and move out, you can't really get rid of them. To the point that it's sometimes very annoying. But they get used to it. Tomorrow would have been my daughter's 30th. Okay. Um, uh, uh, f f uh, okay. I don't think you ever talked about it. This is some heavy shit. Stillborn. Um, 
Now, this may be an awkward question. I, I recognize the term. I don't know its meaning. I'm gonna assume it's like... Uh, they come out uh, unalived. To put it lightly. Yes, okay. Well, fair enough. Jeez, I'm sorry. I mean, hey, if it makes you feel better, they they probably... She probably never knew to begin with. I guess that's like the only sort of mentality you can put in your head. If that makes sense. When people say born sleeping... Yeah, because I think, I, f I feel people would say that because it's more like, um, you try and take the, not really the seriousness out of it, because it's still serious, but you don't try and, like, you don't want it to, m to make it sound so serious. Because if, if it were to happen to me, I'd probably just try and say it that way or joke around it a bit like even though it's sad and and stuff like that can happen i would always just try and say you know what it's like try and joke around about it Is that, is that a bear? Because that looks like a turkey. Oh shit, bro. Bro, I had a dumb truck. Hey, bro, he's massive! Bro, you're so fat! Holy shit! Bro, it looks like he ate the forest. So what job are you going for? Look, it may, it may sound a bit boring, but if it works out, it's mostly going to be administration. <laughs> but it's something I'm probably going to do for a year or two. Um, I'm starting to study coding again on my own free time because uh, I want to maybe go back to, uh, to the IT world. Even though I still do it kind of at work, but it's mostly like hardware related. Uh, but I just, I kind of miss it. But I've only started a few days and I try to keep it consistent. Uh, but I've already missed out yesterday because I, I was so tired from, from work. I, 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 I fell asleep pretty much like an hour after I went back home and I, I woke up at like 11. Which was like four hours later, being so fucking confused. My girlfriend was drawing on the other couch. She just looked at me and like, hello. I'm like, what the fuck happened? Why is it so, why is it getting so dark? I checked the time and I panicked. I was scared. I'm like, I missed my whole evening. It was horrible. Size of that bear's paws. Holy shit. Be free. Ah! <laughs> he was looking at me like, save me. <laughs> <laughs> The little look he gave when he fell down. <laughs> I mean, there were big bears, but I feel like this was actually the biggest bear I've, I've killed so far. Ah, oh, shit. Spriggans, man. Just what I wanted. 
Or wood elementals, as they call it in this game. Well, there's another one there. Honestly, if I can insta-kill them, that'd be the best. I hope it was only those two. Well, there's, a, there's a chest here. Yeah, completely unrelated, but I can, I, I'm in the Frostcliff Mountains, but there's no frost anymore. It's, it's warm. It's so weird because I've, I've never been here. I feel like I could use this to my advantage if there's enemies on this side. No. Would there be anything here? I just feel like it was built this way for a reason, because it looks climbable. Like, put a magic symbol here or something, I don't know, make it, make it exciting. I'm not even really going off the map, but there's, there's nothing. There's a building there. Hmm. Anyways, let me get back to ground. So it's ah, it's called random. We've already had hundreds of these. There's nothing here. Not even a magic symbol, really. This place seems well hidden. Guess we return for now. But literally nothing else here. Still need to still need to even go to that side. I haven't even been there yet. My god, it fucking went dark quickly. Looked away for one second, boom. Means I'll have to be extra careful. I can't see stuff that well. That makes sense. I can't even see through the gra- what the hell? Root weed. Oh, we saw these also near the father. Which is still a scam. That's a female. I feel sc Shit. I feel scammed. Level 18. That's not very high. Okay. There's another wolf there. No, it's, it was a deer, and he just escaped. Shit. That. That it? Man, it's so eerie. It's so quiet around here. There's barely any sound. Karenian arrows are bow of the righteous frost wrath. Ah, but those 80 damage. There's some ruins over there in the distance. Might actually be the end of the path, yes. So this is why I came here to begin with. This is the dangerous reason I'm here. Well, save the game. What am I to expect in this area?
What the fuck? Magic construction? I'm sorry, what? I mean, he's level 50. I'm sort of glad he got stuck. But that's besides the point. That was it. That was it. How much XP for the magic? 400! It's not bad at all. Holy moly. This was ridiculous. Where did this guy come from? I expect the mages. I was just flabbergasted about the magic construction. So what are they protecting here to have a level 50 construction ready to attack me? I must know this. I've never been on this area either, so I don't really know what to expect. Of potion, tanning rack, any strong leather? Yes! Yes, very good. I can upgrade, I can upgrade my last piece of armor because there's a workbench here. Wait, what? Oh, I'm missing a steel ingot. Looking for steel? I can provide everything for the path abiding soldier. I can at least... No, there's no... Oh, damn it. I could have made some silver arrows, but there's no anvil. Or is there? Ambrosia? Eterna arrows, ruined books, fire. I'm trying to get the gold though. Go into first person. Brown bear, rotten flesh, not interesting. Well, I guess now we go in. Don't know what to expect. But I'll start stealthing. You never know. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. There's, there's traps everywhere. Those are going to make a noise. Why is the game freezing so often, man? Every time I want to shoot an arrow. Ah, it's just making me work extra hard to get things working and it sucks because now i have to restart the game yet again <sighs> i assume i can't force exit through this way no i just gotta great this is just amazing uh it doesn't work it's not working It works! Oh my god. Why is this on? Okay. And there he goes. Poop it out. God damn it, man. <sighs> Take 200, let's go. I actually thought it was because of the saves, so I deleted a ton of saves because I had like I saved around 9,000 times in this game because I press F5 pretty much every 10 seconds or so, but it's, it, it's a separate save. So I deleted 13 gigabytes of <laughs> save files or 13.1 gigabytes. 
Because I thought that would make the game slow or something, but nah, it's just not it. Okay, can we retry this again, lads? All right, let's let's uh, let's be gentle this time, shall we? Is everything working? Because I don't have the yeah, everything is uh, that's a lot of saves. Yes, I know. It's because I'm it's be it's become automatic for me to press the button now. Kind of wanted to kill her first. Damn it. That's fine too, I guess. Screw it. Marauder, two bread pieces. I mean, it's just a skiva. That's so annoying, man. Oh god. Shit. Oh god. I'm stuck, man. Stop using magic, you piece of shit. Yee! Fuck! Man, fuck the piggy too. Oh shit, I can't kill it. <laughs> I swear to God, if a rat kills me. Bro, this piggy's immortal. The fuck? Wait, what? Oh! Oh! Yes, he's dead. <laughs> He's gone. I kind of need to wait until I'm fully healed, though. But fuck it. I at least want to check out the area. If I die, I die. There's a lock. There's a lockbox. Oh, stop opening the door like that. Why is there a jewelry box in here? What's the point of having... It's an expert lock. Do I just have a scroll to make it easy? Yep. Probably won't really be worth it, but screw it. Fire resistance by 40% is not bad. Could use that if I get into a, a dangerous fight and reload, obviously, because I, I'm not going to equip it mid-fight. Fucking rats. Health potion, air potion, sick potion. Oh, what's up with rats everywhere? Is he using a cannonball? That's multiple wild mages. Why am I not waiting? <laughs> I'm impatient. What the fuck? Have they experimented on this guy, the poor fucker? Look at him. What the f- What is this? What am I to make of this spot here? They look like they were experimenting, but... There's an Eterna sword. Those are pretty strong too, I guess. It's a one-handed attack, but the thing covers my whole inventory. 42 damage. Hmm. And a summon bow and revive. I guess that's kind of it. I was expecting a little bit more from this specific area. I'm trying to watch the tools. Okay, 
guess it just means they're fucked in the head. I didn't see that person. Save the game! Open the door. Is she locked in here? Oh, she probably had a key. Yeah, it's a marauder. You fucking scum! You'll pay for that. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, why were they in here? Oh, there's there's more to this path. Okay. There's a massive chest. Is there a master lock? It's adept. Oh, but it's close to the beginning, so I just need to figure out whether it's left. It's right. Boom, done. Ping. Ah, set of the Scarlet Knights yet again. Grab it. You are carrying too much. I know I'm fat. I could get rid of these two things. Um, this most stuff kind of sells. I have a lot of leather, though. I could get rid of most of it, I think. I'll probably get rid of the bow, then. Wow, all those carry weight upgrades, and I'm still suffering from it. Yeah, but this door is also locked. Lock it. And this one is Apprentice. Make up your mind, game. Have two doors on Adept. Don't switch the difficulty on the locks. They bring me to the same spot. Oh, I'm back here. I guess there isn't much else to this place. No, that's it. I don't know if that was worth it for going all this all to, all the way here. But it's done. I'll probably go check the upper level to this place before I leave. So it looks like you can kind of go there. No? Okay. Just for show, I guess. Oh, there's a chest. So, oh, 120 pennies in a normal chest. That's unheard of. Would they have anything at the back here? Like a magical symbol or something? Wouldn't be surprising. Very hard to see, though. But well, we should probably get back on the path soon and uh, go towards the quest. I can't see anything, so there's probably something that's going to jump on me. And it's a dra Draugr. Oh, my health. What is attacking me now? I'm not fit for this fight. I am ill-equipped. God. All right, again, I need to eat something. And I kind of need to patiently wait. Oh. Getting through this, I mean, I can at least explore this area a little bit because I've now killed the skeletons around here. Were they protecting something here? So why would you go here? There's a chest. They were protecting a, a grave? Their own graves? 
I can also go down here. But there's nothing. Okay. Plop. Yeah, it's just a just a grave with a massive chest. Okay. I should probably also read all these books so that they disappear from my inventory. It gets rid of one weight, uh, wait, so. Okay. Right. That's like, what, 10 less weight or eight or nine? How, what time is it in the game? 8, 9, 9 p.m. So it's now just going to stay dark for a while. Well. Actually, if I go back to the track, I could go. I, I can go to the old cabin, sleep for a couple hours until it's morning, and then it'll be day, daytime again. I just have to make sure I get there in one piece. Because right now, I can't see anything. It's very dark. Fireflies are the only light source I have. Is a fluffy bear? See ya. There's the cabin. Let's sleep until early morning so I can make most use of the daylight. Uh, I'll sleep around... Will this be enough? Yeah! Sunlight will appear soon and it's already not super dark anymore. Okay, let me find the path again and go up north. Because we have about 25-ish minutes left. I'm sure we'll make it somewhere, but that's if I don't derail. A bit of exploring ain't that bad. But I have 52 silver arrows left, which is a bit problematic. Oh yeah, we're back with snow. And I need my silver arrows again because of the guardian over there. Make sure I use my sneak attack modifier. Oh my god. They always run away. Stat get back here. Alright, take all of my arrows back that I can get. 300 XP. Not bad. Ooh. I like how the arrows actually bounce off them, so I'm gonna assume they have, like, resistance to arrows. So I, I would do more damage with a silver sword than a... Ah, oh, but there's more of them. Fucking hell. Oh, they're fight he's fighting a spider. Okay. Well, I'll be fighting wolves here. What? Yes, eat your own brethren. <laughs> I'm close to leveling up, though. That's kind of good. Even though... <gasps> He's dead. Whoa! Ow! Am 
Man, this place is so not safe, holy shit. Seems normal arrow, normal arrows work on them though. That's good because I don't want to actually waste my silver arrows. Never mind. Thought they needed the ice arrows because some of them, some of the elementals do need it. At least I noticed I do a lot of damage. Oh, I got stuck. Are you serious? No, don't get stuck. Are you? Ah, great. No! You know what? Fuck this shit. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna... Ugh. Jesus. I'm not gonna reload this whole fight just because I got stuck on an object. There's more element... Bro, there's so many of them. Let me first explore this area because this is kind of a cool place. Like a broken down tower and they made like a campfire here. Mana potion, silence. Okay, I'm sorry, I'll shut up. A jewelry box. Level master. Oh my god, this better be good. I mean, again, but I guess this time I can sell it and get some good money, but money is not what I need anymore. Arrows, mentalism. See, this one was even better than what I, I need everything here. Is there more to this place? Take whatever kill I can get close to leveling up. Can use that to get a bit more health. Amelia. Just brings me back down. Oh, there's always elementals to kill. Probably want to use stronger arrows. Maybe Karenian arrows would be the best. Or maybe an actual bolt would, would do the job. Frost Spider Queen dead. Wild Mage. There's a tower here. Oh god, what happened? There's a chest. Oh, a Butcher of Arc volume. Is there another book? My character's glitch, by the way. Oh, never mind. Oh, it was just slightly opened. Okay, in the chest. Assassin Hood. Eh. Do I not have the full Assassin set? Oh, I probably, I probably do, but I put it in the chest in my own house. Because I wanted to enchant it. At least I hope I did. But I probably had a mentality of like, meh, fuck it. Get rid of the whole set now. Oh god, they are level 50. They are very strong, by the way. If I see one of those big spiders again, use some stronger arrows, because I do have them. Granted, 
The, the difference between a rune arrow and a Terna is like fucking. It's just three damage. But I don't give a shit. I gotta use it, I gotta use it. Oh man, this is gonna. He was already damaged. Stop running away. I don't see my arrow. Shit. Oh my god. Yeah, this might become a problem. These are the enemies I'm expecting to kill then. Yee! Yee! That's all I gotta say, peeps. Yee! <sighs> it's so cool, the fact that I've just never been here. Just everything is so new to me now. I love it. Finally something that I don't know as much about. Ooh, ice claw. Very nice. A windmill, really, in the middle of nowhere. Dead. There's an enemy over there. I think it's a Vatir based on his positioning. And I think there's multiple Vatirs here at the windmill. Let me go figure it out. Oh my god. Okay, the guy over there wasn't alarmed. Am I gonna hit him? No. Got him! Alright, let him get his ass over here until he's close enough. Don't want to waste too many arrows. I'll probably still miss, though. Ah, uh, Leop! I missed. <laughs> Just as I said, I would... <laughs> God, I love my aim. You can't make this shit up. Recurring too much to be able to. Fine, get rid of this sword. Drop it. Got the enchantment, anyways. Okay, what's what's over here? What's over here? What's a windmill? Okay, great naming. Appreciate it. Hey. Did I hear something else? It's just that, it's just a just a windmill. Nothing special about it, I guess. And then there's a there's a there's a building over here. You know, aside the forget the monsters, this would be a nice place to live. If there wasn't any danger. Oh! Yeah, this doesn't do any fucking damage. Th this was a bad idea. Well, I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, melee is not my build. Get back to the arrow. I didn't see him, but now I do. I wasn't focused on him to begin with. I apologize. Uh, oh, he teleported. Don't do that. Oh my god, he actually doesn't take that much damage. Sir? Man, it's always scary when they get so close. I need 7 XP to level up. Are you... Yeah, you're funny, aren't you? <laughs> really funny today. Ah! 
health. 100%. Are there any Vatis at the back? No, but there, there, there is a wolf. No Vatis? Am I, am I safe? There's undead over there. All right, let me let me get close to this place and first do a little skedaddle. What to improve? This could be nice. Could be actually very nice to have. Oh, I haven't upgraded this whole spot here yet. Because this is 15% uh, that the damage of a melee attack is completely intercepted. Might be good. I guess. But I don't, the thing is, I don't want to really get hit. That's my whole thing. Looking for stuff that needs, like, multiple... In, uh, improvements but it seems like this is kind of it hmm I mean I guess this would be good I kind of like, I don't really care much about the memory points anymore. I feel like I'm kind of happy with what I have for my build. But I just do it for the the extra health. Oh, there's multiple of them? Oh, but that's just, that's just awesome. Oh yeah, a third one? Sure. I don't know how to do that. A Fatir leader. Yeah, this makes sense. Fucking hell, bro. Ooh, they, they could maybe not get here. Oh shit. They are going to hide though. I'm actually so happy I was just able to find this spot here. I can't really... Is the game freezing again? Are you out of your fucking mind, bro? Stop freezing! I'm trying to play the game! Every time when it when I draw my arrow, it keeps happening. It's so annoying. But you know what? You know what? I was close to finishing the stream anyway, so I'm just gonna end it here. So I just <laughs> cause the least damage because I don't want to restart the game just to play for eight to ten minutes more. It has been fun though, regardless. We haven't gotten to the excavation. I kinda didn't expect this to happen because this there's too much. It's a new area. I need to explore basically everything. Um so yeah, but uh, we'll be back another day with the stream. For now, I'm going to take a small break. Then I'm going to go record Risen. Be sure to still, I keep reminding people, remind yourselves that there is currently a Let's Play going on on my YouTube channel, completely outside streams. So it's all new content. There's currently two episodes out for Risen 3, and I have already recorded five. And there was about the sixth one 
will be recorded tonight and the third one will be uploaded tonight or tomorrow morning so there's 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 some videos out there uh but for now i'm gonna leave it here i first need to figure out how to even get to the goddamn obs because it never works <laughs> um there you go all right i was able to quit jesus all right thank you all for watching it's been an absolute pleasure and i'll see you all in the next stream peace <laughs>